Tomorrow, I'm flying with my wife, Nienke, to Dresden in Germany to join a symposium about dealing and collecting in Asian ceramics in Europe in the late 17th and early 18th century. And we are very excited to go to Dresden because we share the same taste as Augustus the Strong, the King of Poland and the Elector of Saxony, for especially Chinese porcelain. And for instance, vases like this can be seen in Dresden. Same as this one. Same as these big blue and white pieces. The Augustus the Strong had the maladie de porcelain, the illness, the disease of collecting Chinese art. And the interesting part is that we share the same disease, the same maladie de porcelain. Here on the table, you find typical examples of um, Chinese porcelain objects that you can see in his collection. And fascinating of his collection that in 1721, Augustus had an inventory made of all his Chinese and Japanese porcelain. And each individual piece has been engraved with an individual number that can be traced in the still existing uh, register of the inventory. This is very important in dating Chinese and Japanese porcelain because we know that this plate was made in 1721 or earlier. Same as, for instance, this vase. Here you can clearly see the engraved uh, mark of Augustus the Strong. This is called an old inventory number. We call it the Johanneum number. All this to be seen in Dresden. We will keep you updated about the symposium and afterwards we're going to tell you all about what we've learned, experienced and seen during this fantastic symposium. See you next time.